guys how are you guys doing i hope you guys are having a fantastic day so i hope you guys are having a fantastic day so far well welcome to stella zone if you're a new subscriber i want to say thank you and welcome to my channel okay all right so this is a quick recipe i have a video but i know once i put this on instagram everybody's people are going to ask me if i have a recipe for this so i'm just making light soup with a little twist too so i have my chicken i had um let me say i have the hen the hard one that's what I got, okay? So I have the cooking, and what I seasoned it with is ginger, garlic, and onion. Just blend it and add it that, and then you can add some seasoning. Um, your cube uh, chicken seasoning, chicken bouillon to it if you want. Taste it before you add salt. And here, I have some snapper. This is mangrove snapper. I had a, um, it says a medium-sized one, but it looks large to me. So when I cut it up, I had about five, okay? Five pieces when I... I cut it up. I'm gonna add it to my soup. And what I did was I cleaned the fish, you know, and then cut it up. And what I have on top of it is also some of the onion, ginger, um, and garlic blended on here. And I squeezed half a lime juice. If you have lemon, you can use half a lime juice. So I'm going to let this sit because I'm not going to. Normally, what I would do is I would steam my meat before adding it to my soup. And I'm not doing that. I will add it to my soup. And then when you come here, my kitchen is a mess. So um, excuse my mess. Okay. So what I have in here, I would have, I did not mean to do a video. So this is um, what I'm going to blend. Um, I have carrots here, onion, um, habanero pepper, red bell pepper here. And um, this you see here is eggplant that I had boiled. And I had um, turkey berry, abedru, abedru. I have that. So I'm going to blend that and then turn that in here for my soup. So that's basically it. And then I'll let this cook for a few minutes for maybe about 10 minutes and then i'll add my fish to it so i'll show you as you go but for now i'm just going to blend this and i'll, I'll strain it i have tomatoes in here okay i have two medium size or two small size tomatoes that's what i have put this and quickly strain it before adding my water Water to it. So you strain it very well. You don't have to throw this away. You can recycle the chaff. What you can do is you can blend it smoothly. This is all veggies here. <clears throat> Excuse me. So you can blend it smoothly and then add it to your um, stew if you make stew. Yeah. You can add it to your tomato stew or your palm nut soup, your peanut butter soup. Just you can blend this, put it in a container and throw it in the freezer and you can reuse it. All right, guys. So after I added my desired um, quantity or uh, let's say amount of water to my soup, it depends on um, how many servings you're going to be making. If you're going to be making a large or a smaller quantity. But I, can, I bought this and it will probably be about four to five cups of water. What do you think? I did not measure it so just so I'm just going to bring my soup to a boil so you see I'm going to let and this is just the chicken in here I'm going to let it boil for about 10 minutes and then I'll go ahead and add my fish directly to my soup and then my fish will cook in my soup so now the soup is going to cook for 10 minutes okay if you don't want that fishy smell Make sure you add your ginger, garlic, onion, and blend it. If you have cloves, you can throw a little bit like cloves powder in there. It will help get rid of the smell. And then you can add it directly to your soup or you can steam it, bake it. But this is a different thing I'm doing today. So stay tuned and let's, we'll see the desired results, okay? I almost forgot this part. Oh my goodness. So this was from um, Thanksgiving Day, um, turkey neck, which I have broken into piece, uh, three pieces or four. And the giblets uh, goes as the, yeah, like the gizzard. Uh, yeah, you don't need to know. It's okay. <laughs> so all you need to do is it was from Thanksgiving. This is um, a sorted soup. That's what I would call it. So next thing, I'm going to add my fish. Does not smell too fishy. Does, does not smell fishy. It's gonna go here. 
and it's going to cook okay so i bring the heat back up again and so now the next thing i'm doing is i added my meat i'm going to let it cook for about at least the fish needs at least about 15 10 to 15 minutes to cook so that is exactly this beautiful soup uh, what was the name i gave it um assorted assorted soup is done you can see the oil i did not add any oil but it's from the fish and from the chicken as well the fish is cooked very well you can mm -hmm. see the soup um taste it has a little bit of sweetness like not over sweet to it it's from the carrot yes ghana when we make um light soup we don't add carrot to it but that's the beauty of making your own food you can add whatever vegetables you want as a baby Oh, this looks so good. Fish and chicken light soup. Mm. I, I hope you enjoyed um, this recipe. Give this video a thumbs up. If you've not subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. You can have this with fufu, banku, or you can even have it on the side by itself. You, can, you don't have to add anything. The, the meat and the fish will fill you up. So this... We too, we too are going to enjoy this soup. So until I come your way again with another simple recipe, stay blessed, remain in God. Bye-bye. See you next time. See you next time. Hey, thanks for watching Stella Zone. To never miss a beat, to never miss a video, you can hit the big subscribe button. That's probably going to be floating somewhere here or right here. Um, if you want to watch other videos, we have them going either on either side here or right below. Of course, follow Stella on Stella Zone TV on Instagram, Stella Zone on Facebook, and of course, leave a comment below on this video. Like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you at the next one.